Hey Darwin. Yeah. Here, can you hold this for me? Yeah, you bet. Hey guys, how you doing? It's the Honeydew Carpenter and the always beautiful Mrs. Honeydew Carpenter is behind the camera. Um, she has these trained chickens that like to jump up on these cups. Come on. <laughs> Anyways, hey guys, this is a video you're gonna want to watch all the way to the end. Um, it is crazy. The dynamic of the new ingredient, the dust creep, using sawdust in it, completely changes the dynamic of this stuff. Um, I am more motivated than ever. I have a pump system that I've drawn up that I need to build so that we can pump this stuff into the walls. We just used a container and poured it into the walls, but I mean, it still, it was just a test, just an experiment, and it turned out fantastic. We're essentially pumping the aircrete into a uh, six inch gap in a uh, six inch wall and it is crazy the dynamic of this stuff so stay tuned clear to the end there will be a coupon code for um, everyone that they can get the uh, foam mate on Etsy for a way reduced price we're talking you know over a hundred bucks off on these packages so anyways Enjoy. I'm not ready to run just yet. I gotta fill up these. Uh... Is this plastic that something that's just going to stay up permanently? No, this once this uh, will pull the form off and continue to let it cure with the plastic on. But after a day or two of letting it stiffen up, we'll just peel the plastic off the air crew. Would it do anything harm to leave it on? Uh, no. But eventually, I'm going to want to plaster this wall. And so we'll need to wet the aircrete and then spray the plaster on with stucco mate and smooth it so it'll be in lieu of sheetrock. Hmm. If you wanted to put sheetrock on, um, you could just leave it on. And I'll bring the form in, we'll screw the form on, and then we'll dump the aircrete in through these pockets. Are you ready, babe? Yep. yep.
I got that on camera. I lost my Wow, it actually filled, it stayed higher than I thought it would. It did pretty good, didn't it? I'm actually surprised a little bit. At how well it worked? I, I expect it to be uh, lower. Yeah, but, yeah. I mean, that was... It's almost a 55 gallon drum, so right by volume, the 55 gallon drum was supposed to bring it up halfway. So, this is really, really dense. Um, I'm glad it as it fell down and plopped in, it, it leveled out because we poured it all on this corner. You know what? That gives me hope. You can actually pump into a wall real easy, especially with this mix.